What's going on everyone? Welcome back. I hope everybody's having a great day. Hey guys, every now and then I do a video about somebody else's finds. You see me doing this several times. Um, we're going to do one by uh, a young lady. Her name is uh, Sarah Michaels. Now you've heard this name before. She's a big supporter of the channel, just like many of you are. Anybody who supports the channel gets nothing but kudos from me. Uh, because you're supporting a channel that you love, and I greatly appreciate each and every one of you guys. All right, now a quick background about her. She's uh, a writer for like um, like beauty magazines like Elle. Uh, she's a photographer. Let me show you. You can see her right here. Uh, modeling, all kinds of stuff like that there. Um, you know, again, everything to do with, you know, beauty stuff and she also supports the world wildlife fund as well as many other things so very successful like anything else it's like any other job that you do you put your mind to it you'll be successful now this one here you can see the top you know again this is her page now as you scroll down look at this i'm just gonna keep scrolling she's got a description on every single thing do this now, you guys may remember this part right here because this was in this video here. Now, I did this in, you can see it right here, on 11-2-2019. But I also did one earlier, and that was on 2-3, so February 3rd, 2018. Now, you can see this weird structure right here in the middle, right there. In fact, I can make the screen like this. And it's right there, and you can see the shape of the base of this thing. Now, she told me that she became a sub to my channel because I had done this very area. Now, she's been looking at this before I did this video. Now, you can see she's got all kinds of, uh, she'll put annotations on these, uh, a, a big-time description of what she feels she's seeing and what she believes is there. Um, uh, this photo here, which I'm going to show you up close, she's showing this right here, which she believes like a, like a fog or like the helium-3 that she believes they are mining. And you can see what she's drawn here. Looks like a cable shovel as she described it. And you can see it here in the right-hand corner. I can make that a little bit bigger so you guys can see this keep going and like i said here's the picture she's showing and i'm going to show you that because i you know it's it's cool that she found this um but as you keep going guys look at this pipe holes in in the rock and there's actually one sticking right out of this rock here and you can see that just barely in the shadows but it's there right just awesome so she's done mars stuff as well uh which i think is awesome now you might be saying chris why are you showing us her page in it well clearly because all her, her work is on her page but it's not just that. It doesn't matter what profession you are, what walk of life you are. Anybody can get into this, and a lot of people have, right? You guys are now tearing these photos apart yourself. you got Photoshop, manipulating software to bring this stuff out better. And without sounding chauvinistic, I love the idea of women are getting into this. And a lot of you ladies around my um, channel who are sub to me are doing the very same thing. So kudos to everybody who's doing this. And I've said this before. Anybody who gets into this and analyzes these photos and you know, finds this stuff for themselves, I've done my job. That was the whole idea. You see what's on my channel, and you go after it yourself, and you rip these photos apart, like she has done, like all of you guys have been doing, and really going to town on these things. So kudos to everybody out there as well. And a big thank you to Sarah. Much love to her as well. Now, when we go into Photoshop, here's the photo she's got here. Now, again, I had this video here, and I'll show you to it briefly again, uh, right here. When I did this, I didn't look at the adjacent crater. And if I did, it was just very brief. You can see right here where she has done this. Let's make this a lot, lot bigger, right? Okay. Construction equipment, cable shovel. Also, you can see the platforms, which she's got right here. This one here, this large one, which I've showed. And it looks like there's something underneath it, guys, like some kind of square structure. At least that's the way it looks. You can see that. Look at this. Just underneath it. It looks like it's black. Now, you might say, well, that's shadowing, and that could very well be true. But it also looks like it goes underground over here, and there's several pieces right there. But have a close look at this stuff here. If you look at this, you might say, well, she showed more of a square-bodied uh, uh, cable shovel, as she says. What I see is more of a pointed object, kind of like this, something more modern. And you can see, you'll see this a little bit here, a little bit better. Um, and this thing coming down like this, you can see it's, it's kind of squared off. I actually messed it up, but it's squared off in the back. But look carefully at the pieces over here. This is what she was saying, how it looks like it's coming up, going up like this here, and going over. The other thing to notice is this item right here. It literally is a tower. You can see this thing coming down, right? 
You see multiple pieces sticking out of it. It's very reflective at the top, as you can see. And this thing comes down like this. It's like a giant tower. Something's near it. She also has these things which they, she calls X-Drones. And I'm going to show you that right now. Here's a photo she had laid out, which is really cool. I did not do this. This is her work. And she's got it numbered to like this. Right here, uh, moon near side dotted yellow box indicates location of two open mine pits. You see one here, and then when you look at it, here's this up close photo. Okay. She has the description right here twin pits. She's showing right there one and two. Here you go. Come over to here, and this is what she's talking about X drone and then cable shovel. I kind of like this in here, uh, like Dragon or Godzilla. What I see is this crane type thing. And you can see what looks like these pieces coming off of it going up. And then you can see what looks like this tripod thing. And I'll show you that a little bit better. These two pieces hanging off. Um, and we get that structure. Here's what I was talking about as far as that structure. This is cool. Look what they've done here. You can see with this green right here. You can see it goes like this. goes up. It's over. It's painted. You can see it going down like this. Look through it. You can see a round top. The line of this, the back side of this thing goes like this and goes right through the green area. Look at it carefully. And then you have what looks like these um, these pieces sticking out, like kind of like a wooden dummy, if you guys know what those are. The wooden dummies for like martial artists. Um, you see that there. You can also see what looks like square structures right down here in the bottom or different like platforms, if you will, right there. See that? And it looks like there's something right on top of that. We got some more photos here. Here's a more up close. And now you can see this piece right here on the right hand side. Notice this piece right here. It looks like some kind of large machine or something like that. Look at the pieces coming off of it. Looks like it has this weird fork type thing sticking out. And you got a tripod uh, excavator like it shows right here. I said this earlier. Something either some kind of really tall crane type thing or some kind of machinery. She calls these mechanical devices storage facilities. Uh, you got to see the actual rim of the, the uh, crater. And look at the straight pieces right here. See that? Inside this. I also want you to take note of this. Check this piece out right here. It goes like this. It's kind of rounded. Has something sticking right out of the center. See that? And has this body to it. What do you suppose that is? Okay. Um, she called it a large swinging mechanical tiller. I'm not sure if she's talking about that particular one, but that's what... I see something that's round, though, and sticking out, right? At least that's my interpretation. I'm not saying that's what it is. We can see this here. Again, just, guys, look at it with your magnifying glasses. Awesome, awesome stuff. And again, I really didn't see this stuff. She had a good eye on this. And like the other photo I just showed you earlier, the same one in uh, Photoshop. See where it says platforms. And now, guys, take a look at the things that weren't pointed out. Like here. Right on the right-hand side, you can see what looks like a square piece, pretty much square, platform. Okay? Right there with two darker pieces on top of it. All you got to do is look at the other pieces surrounding it. There's one way up here just below this red line. Looks like there's uh, some kind of rectangular piece that's lighter. Look at the very small, small pieces. And it all makes sense when you really take a good close look at this stuff. Okay. Again, right here, you get that piece. Of course, you have to cock your head a little bit to the right. And you see these pieces sticking out. And again, you can see that right there, that tower. We've got this one here. Now, she's saying it's like a plume or something coming off of this as well. And what she says, and she can see some square pieces, what looks like a scaffolding. Now, t truthfully, I don't see it, but that doesn't mean it's not there. Some of you guys may see it. I see more, the more larger objects right here, uh, like she described. Here's, here's another photo with a filter on it. And guys, again, take a look at this. Look at this round piece. Looks like a, almost like a giant water tower type thing. But look at this. comes down straight in the back right through the green comes straight down it's like they just drew over this see the green they just drew over it just to hide it uh, yeah not cool there's a like a bluish purplish uh filter right there and you can see again the backside going through this this thing's quite tall guys i don't know what would do that naturally right all right now let's have a look at the other photo i've got here this is where she was saying that has this weird tripod kind of thing with these things hang overhanging. And you see that right there. 
and it looks like it almost like they're coming down like that. Check this out. Let's go black and white. And what I try to do is put the white through this. You can see the difference. See it? I try to put the white, and you can see where it's kind of like blurred out where I, I try to mock it back in. And again, notice the line right here. You can see this thing still there where they painted this in. It's like they did everything they could to try to hide what's really in this photo. And that's what they did to it. Look at that. We'll clear it up a little bit. And what I find interesting about this thing is it looks like it's actually in this kind of squared off area. I don't know if you guys can see that. It appears to have something going like this across it. Almost has these weird pieces coming like this. Going up and over. Like that there. Here it is back in color. And try to bring out that white that was in there. You can, again, you can see the line of it going like this. Straight down. And you've also got what looks like, it looks like a piece protruding, but it also looks like it kind of goes all the way down as well. See that? Pretty cool. Um, and again, we've got this object right here. Well, again, looks like that weird crane type thing. And I thought that was pretty interesting because I totally skipped over this crater, which is basically adjacent from the other one. And it's, it's pretty cool. So I'm glad she's seen this. And I love the idea, all of you guys doing this. You'll be like, Chris, man, you didn't see this, but check this one out in this photo. And it could be the Mars photo. The moon, it doesn't matter. You guys have a keen eye for this stuff. And like I told you guys before, I'm no better than you guys are. You guys can pull this out just as well as I can, and she's done the same, except she's seen this thing, and I think it's awesome. So good eye on this, uh, Sarah. That's cool. That's absolutely cool. Now in my video, I actually talked about this right here, where it looks like in the lower left corner, it almost looks like it goes underground. Look at these other little objects. You go in right here on the right, and you get one here on the the top center just underneath the red line but look at the all the smaller pieces again use your magnifiers crazy crazy stuff all right guys that's pretty much it man i mean here's the video that i've done i'll give you the link to both of these check them out i think you'll really enjoy them and guys check out the tower in this thing what you can literally see this in the photo without doing anything to it the only reason why i dock in these so we can see more shadows more defined lines um, and here you go exactly like this here. Look at the shape of this thing. That is not natural in any way, shape, or form. I literally had people tell me, oh, that's just a crater. Really? That particular shape, just like that. Clearly, that's intelligently made. Look at the piece right here. It's just in the blue area. Look at these pieces right here. There's one, two white pieces, like another structure sitting right on the side of it. What is it? It's anybody's guess, right? Um, again, guys, I'll give you the links to check out both of these videos. There's a lot of interesting things in and again, a big thank you to Sarah Michael for submitting this and saying, Chris, check out my work. I think you'll love this. Uh, thank you for your support. Always appreciate it, as well as everybody else here who supports the channel. Uh, much love to you guys. And much love to you, Sarah, for doing this. Uh, keep up the great work. You're awesome. All right, guys. When I see that, I see what looks like some kind of machinery. I see this what looks like this large cylindrical object vertically standing up in that crater. It looks like machines in different parts of that. It's just crazy. And I believe I actually just looked it over real quick, but really didn't get into it. Uh, so I'm glad that Sarah did. You guys will get the links to that page. You guys can get the photo and analyze the stuff yourself. Uh, just a lot of crazy stuff. And even the stuff that we didn't point out. Look at the stuff that's laying there. Just look at it with your magnifying glass and check it out because there's so much to see. Little things that look like structures. Little things inside and outside the crater. Drop your comments and thoughts below. Please like and share. Always appreciate it. And don't forget to give the video a thumbs up. It helps get this video out. If you're not subbed, please do so. And don't forget to hit that notification bell on the right-hand side of it so you'll be notified of all the new upcoming videos. Anyway, guys, with that, I'm going to let you go. Have yourself a great evening, and I'll talk to you soon. Peace.